Hey Virgo, <clears throat> excuse me, thank you for checking out my channel for the love of water to row. My name is Kianti and I'm going to bring you guys a reading. It'll be about love, it'll be about whatever comes out, but it'll definitely be about you. Again, this is going to be for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, as well as Cross Watchers. Everything I say won't resonate for every Virgo on the planet. Virgo, use your discretion and put yourself where you go in the messages, okay? If I get it right for you guys, make sure you give me the like, comment, subscribe, and share. And if you guys are interested in booking me for a private reading, my email information will be provided in the description box below. All right, Spirit, tell me what's going on for Virgo. What does Virgo need to know? What do they need to see? If you're interested in booking me for an Etsy read as well, I offer them Virgo. And then for $10, the link to my Etsy shop is in the description box as well. Two more for Virgo, Spirit. Those two came out together. All right. Let's see what we got here, Virgo. Just, oh, shit. I didn't know it was that many. Okay. Just give me a second. <coughs> okay. Virgo, just to show you really quickly what I have and we're going to talk about it. I have tripping on you. I have dodging a bullet. I have girl fighting. These three came out together. Waiting, creeping, and an offer. So, Virgo, here's what I'm seeing, and this is how I'm seeing the situation. Virgo, I feel like there's an energy where something or someone was tripping on you, for sure. There's an energy, like, for, for real, something, some kind of energy was tripping off of you. Virgo, I see you dodging a bullet in a situation. With dodging a bullet and girl fighting, I feel like there's an energy, like I said, somebody could be tripping on you, definitely be, because you're not, you're avoiding them and you're not competing for this person or this this situation or whatever it is but i do feel like there's an energy of of definitely it feels like we're tripping on you an energy had you messed up energy had you messed up effed up you dodged a bullet and it's because i feel like it's because you didn't compete or something here i feel like whatever was tripping off of you you avoided some sort of catastrophe you dodged some sort of bullet because somebody definitely be tripping off of you because you're not willing to compete or, or any of that, right? You're avoiding them, right? You're avoiding the competition. You're avoiding any of that. So somebody could be tripping on you because you're doing this, but I see you just doing this period, right? And Virgo, what I see happening is, I feel like this, this, is, this could be you or an energy coming towards you. There's an energy of sitting back for a moment, taking a look at something and getting some sort of offer here. So it could definitely be somebody sit, watch, sit, watching and waiting, you, waiting and watching to make an offer towards you, Virgo, for sure, right? That's, somebody could be tripping on you because you completely avoid them because you're not, in the, you're not in the mood to compete, to argue, none of that. You don't want to be at war with anybody. You're just avoiding it. You're avoiding something here. <clears throat> Virgo, I also feel like some of you dodged a bullet. Like we're tripping on you and dodging bullets and girl fight, you dodged some sort of bullet. I feel like you made some sort of judgment call and you're making the right decision. And I see you looking out for something with waiting and creeping an offer. There's an offer coming in. Virgo, some of you got your eye on something. And whatever you got your eye on is going to be good with an offer. You got your eye on something here. This could definitely be you watching, chasing. See, this is an offer. Moves in silence. Yes, yes, yes. Virgo, I feel like you withdrew from something for sure. And I also feel like some of you have somebody watching you person that's moving in silence they tripping on you they waiting and watching they're gonna make an offer they're gonna come after you they're gonna chase you and it's because you're avoiding them i feel like i'm gonna pull a few messages from the heart on these energies for y'all clarify again virgo make sure you take care of me with the like comment subscribe and share if i get it right for you and if you're interested in booking me please email me okay i'm going on this one all right let's see what we have here under there is release i feel like this is what you did let me see here. Look, Virgo, watching you in endings. Yes, I told you, Virgo. I told you. I told you. Virgo, you could have, like, if somebody was tripping on you, Virgo, you could have ended it. This person could be watching you. I definitely feel like there's some sort of energy where it, it is. Or, let me just read what the cards say. They've been watching your social media to see what you post and get clues to know how to approach you. I told you endings they entered your life to test you teach you bring out the very best in you now their part of your story is over see for some of you there's something about you weren't i feel like you're not you weren't tripping on something 
you you decided to avoid a situation to dodge some sort of bullet to dodge some sort of um conflict or competition you did the right thing virgo you did you did. I feel like you would. It could have been a situation where you were put on under pressure and you were being watched. You made the right decision to avoid something. You did. But also, somebody is watching your social media and tripping on you. Definitely want, wanted to test you, and you. And I feel like you avoid them, and it's because you avoid them. You avoid this entire conflict with someone here. What's here? Permanent mark. You left a permanent mark on their heart that can't be erased, even if they tried. You will always be remembered. Yep. Yep. There's some of you that could have been a physical fight here, a permanent mark and a physical fight. For sure. You might have avoided that, Virgo. You might have avoided a physical confrontation for somebody. Literally, it could have been that. But I do see for some of you, this is somebody who, who feel, feel this way about you. You're avoiding them. And it's because you feel like you're not going to compete. You're not going to argue. You're not going to fight. You don't, you don't want to be at war. But this person is watching your social media. You left a permanent mark on them. For sure. Now, we'll clarify waiting, creeping, and an offer, Virgo. I do see some of you sitting back, waiting, and looking out for something. I see you looking out for something, and I do feel like you're going to get it. Look, divine intervention. They are experiencing many tower moments in their life where it is where it's helped them gain clarity in this connection. Some of you do have somebody that's looking at you that way, for sure. For others of you, I feel like you dodged some sort of bullet and it was divine intervention. Virgo, I feel like you might have made the right move because you knew you, were, you had eyes on you or that you were being watched. It could definitely been something about like not um, not giving in to a confrontation. Mm -hmm. For some of you, I feel like that's exactly what it, was, what it is, but not for all of you. Just put it where it goes, Virgo. But I do feel like for others of you, this is somebody watching you. They are. They're having many tower moments. They're watching, and they're going to make an offer here. Okay, I'm going to get a couple more on this, and then we're going to clarify with tarot. Guys, again, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share if I get it right for you, my beautiful Virgos. And cross roster and cross watchers. Okay, time, weight, cycles, and infinity. Here under the deck, I'm tripping on you, a soulmate. I'm telling you, similar friendships, romantic partners. Some of you do have a soulmate. Watching you, it says it. They tripping on you. They watching you. It could definitely be because you ended something here. I feel like you are the one that dodged the bullet. You you dodged the confrontation. You dodged some sort of argument, some sort of competing energy. And this is why somebody can't forget you. You will not be forgotten for doing that, Virgo. There's an energy where you not be you will not be forgotten for 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 whatever for for avoiding something here. What's here? Anxiety, scared, panic. See, somebody could definitely feel like you're getting away from them. Mm. And for, for waiting, creeping, and an offer, divine intervention, a journal, this is communication. Some of you do have an offer coming in. The offer you've been waiting on that you've been keeping your eye on, it's coming in, Virgo. I see that. I also feel like there's some sort of divine intervention that's happening between you and someone. They are experiencing many tower moments in their life that is where it's helped them gain clarity on this connection. <clears throat> for sure. So it's like somebody had to really go through some shit, right, Virgo? They had to really go through some shit. And you could have really had to, like, avoid this person, dodge this person, right? They they could have really, I'm Virgo, I'm hearing you say they lost their damn mind, right? They got the tripping. And you ended it. This person could definitely be, like, watching you. You got a permanent mark on them. They're never going to forget you. And I definitely feel like it's because you avoided them. Dodge the bullets. You start blocking, blocking negativity, escaping crazy people. Protected from haters, like you just you just decided not to do it. This person is waiting to say something. They watching your social media for sure. They waiting. They want to speak, and it, and it's, it could be because about some stuff that they got going on in their own. Like I do see someone getting ready to make this offer from you, but this is a person that moves in secrecy and silence. Virgo, I also see you definitely could be in this energy where you're getting ready to go after something new and get ready to move in secrecy and silence. Either you have your eye on something, Virgo, or someone has their eye on you. Let me, let me write that down. So Virgo, whatever it is, you're eyeing, you're doing the right thing or if, if, if you have your eyes on something, but I also feel like something has their eye on you, okay? And there is some sort of offer coming in. There's communication. There's divine intervention coming in here. Give me some for tripping on you and watching you and endings here for Virgo. The Knight of Wands. It could be a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sag. Somebody was tripping on you, right? Somebody was wilding out. <clears throat> you ended it. It could be a soulmate. 
I definitely feel like this is you definitely not wilding out and deciding to like keep your composure. The tower could be a Scorpio, I'm telling you. But look at that eye on that tower. Mm-hmm. Watching you. I don't know. I feel like some of you avoided a confrontation because you were being watched. Like, I don't know. But you did the right thing. Give me one for uh the dodging bullets. Let me just yeah, let me give one. I feel like this is what you did, Virgo. I feel like you withdrew from a competition. You 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 avoided an argument. You could have avoided a physical fight. You could you you avoided a competition. You avoided competing. And because you done that, you left a permanent mark on the situation. Look at you. The nine of pentacles. This is you. Single, solid, stable, and abundant. You got the seven of swords, the three of cups, and the high priestess. See, there's a lot of secret, secret energy here. Secret, secret. You could be dealing with a Pisces, an air sign, a water sign. A high priestess is someone who knows a secret. The seven of swords is someone who has secrets or being strategic or keeping secrets. The three of cups is a situation probably involving three people. And look what's under here, the ace of swords. Yep. You could have avoided, like, I don't know. You could have avoided, I feel like somebody, you avoided something about some sort of competing energy with something. There is secrets here. There's multiple people involved in some, that was involved in something. But I know with the Ace of Swords, this is the yes. This is the one I'm saying is true here. But it where it goes, Virgo. So let's see what this offer that's coming in is about. Because I for damn sure see it. Virgo, either you are sitting back waiting and you got your eye on something and divine intervention is going to kick in and you're going to get this offer and get this communication here. Or this is what's happening with someone who's keeping their eye on you. I, but I, what I do know is there's some, definitely somebody that got their eye on something. Waiting and watching. Watching and waiting. Yes, that's what this is, Virgo. Yes. Give me one more. Give me some for this for Virgo. What's this offer coming in for Virgo? Look, the Ace of Swords. Yes, I'm telling you, there's the offer. There it is. I'm trying to tell you, Virgo. And look, the Queen of Pentacles. There you are, Taurus, Virgo, Cap Virgo, Capricorn energy. There you go, the Queen of Queen of Pentacles. Judgment, a decision going in your favor. Someone could definitely want a reconciliation. The Moon. See, this is still on the shadow side of stuff. You could be dealing with a Water sign. There's a King of Cups under there too. Give me one more on this offer that you've been waiting on, or someone's waiting to give you the Seven of Cups. I feel like that's why somebody's waiting for some things to figure out. Seven of Cups is options, illusions, or confusions. Three of Wands. There's something that someone is either... There you go. The, 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 uh, <laughs> the Hermit. There's something to figure out here. But Virgo, what I damn know for sure is it's either somebody is waiting to make this offer to you or you got your eye on something. And if you got your eye on something, Virgo, you're going to get it. I love you guys. If it resonates, make sure you give me the like, comment, subscribe, and share. If you're interested in booking me, please email me. I appreciate your time, your patience, your energy, all that. And if you're interested in $10 Etsy reads, the link to my Etsy shop is in the description box below. Bye, Virgo.